our maid of honor, Bridget Horan, and our best man, Shane Kelly. Ladies and gentlemen, we're going to ask you to please rise. Now, before we bring in Jen and Matt, I wanted to tell you a little bit about their love story. It was a brisk fall evening. The Windsor Warriors were losing 14 to 0. Bridget, Jenny's best friend, dropped her ticket, and as she and Jen walked towards the bleachers, being the proper gentleman that Matthew is, he stopped and picked up Bridget's ticket. Handing it to her, he caught sight of this blonde bombshell. Jenny, of course. Choking on his words, he said a quick hello. The hello was the easy part. Finding out who this bombshell was would prove to be more, well, kind of easy. He turned to his friends and got a quick confirmation that this was forever heard of but never seen Jen Weinholtz. Later that evening, Matt went home and found Jen on MySpace. That is before it was creepy. Their first conversation lasted hours. Everything just fell into place. They knew that they had found their soulmate. Funny how your soulmate can be just two blocks away and it can still take more than 17 years to find them. When asked why Jen wanted to marry Matt, she said, quote, he makes me laugh until I cry and sharing my life with him up to this point has been amazing. His creative and fun-loving energy inspires me and keeps me grounded. What can I say? I love this gooseball. When asked why Matt wanted to marry Jen, he said, What can I say? I love her. Some might say that five years is a long time to make a girl wait, but I knew she was worth it. I knew she would stick by my side. Jen makes my life complete. Without her, I would be lost in a world of zombies. She is the reason I strive for perfection. She is the reason I am who I am. I can't wait for our roots to grow even stronger. Ladies and gentlemen, please a warm welcome for Mr. and Mrs. Graham. Ladies and gentlemen, our Brian Groomer to come right out and do their first dance. Of course, you may be seated at this time. 